Oh, baby, we back at it. What is up, ladies and gentlemen, just boys and girls, and bees of a lady safe society? Oh, baby. Oh, we back at it. Our main man, J Jaw, to the Jawsington, aka Let's Game It, not in, but out. I made one billion in five seconds, and it changed reality. Teach me your ways, oh wise one. Y'all know the deal. Let's game it out. Link in the description juice. Let's get him. Got him. Red dot him. Come back to Let's Game It Out. We're playing some Hydraneer today. Oh, My favorite yeah. game about mining where I've spent several videos not doing any mining at all. Unless you count mining for fish or whatever is left behind by explosions like this oh, or yeah. this or oh, nuclear yeah. fallout left by this. Oh, but hey, yeah. who knows? Maybe we'll do some actual mining today. I oh, and it. also this video is sponsored by, by Opera GX. GX. But we'll talk about that in a little bit. For now, it's new game time. So if you're new to Hydraneer, let me break it down for you. Here's a shovel. Uh -huh. There's a river. Take the shovel. Walk it over to this bridge. Drop it off the side and make a wish. Well, <laughs> looks like we've done all we need to do today. Time to head to the local pub. There nah, go. I'm kidding. Go back to the river, regretfully pick up your shovel, throw it in a wet, sad pile, and then grab these other tools over here, which includes little bucket, big bucket, and brush bucket. Oh, well, there's so much to pick up here. What am I going to do? Well, they wouldn't put it here if they didn't want us to <laughs> use it, right? You go in here, also go in here, bring you along for the ride, and what the hell, let's bring this map we're never going to use. Okay, and now let's pull this thing all all the way over here. Great, we did it. So here's how this is supposed to work. We dig, <laughs> put the dirt in the tiny bucket, uh -huh. let go of our shovel, which after uh -huh. much collision finally comes to a resting Bring point. Up. Yeah, yeah, that's what I meant. And then we take that bucket, dump it in the other bucket, go get some water. Now <laughs> you, all right, quench hey, big buckets yeah, thirst, take your brush, scrubby scrub. Scrubby scrub, scrub, scrub. Just as we intended. Now grab your card and Huh, oh, huh, right? how about that, huh? You know, can we cut out some of the work here? Can I just take this card and just bring it all the way into the ocean and then <laughs> back it of out? Course. Will that fill my buckets with water? Or, you know, Cart, come happen. on. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Flip over. Okay, let's go ahead and try this. Put uh -huh. it in the water. I mean, uh -huh. this seems promising. Let's hedge our bets and put it under oh, this gosh. waterfall. And while that's happening, let's take a moment to talk about our, our sponsor, sponsor Opera, Opera GX. GX. The first browser built specifically for gamers. And since us gamers demand a lot of our browsers, for funsies, I decided to do a little performance test. Let's overtax the browser and see oh, what happens. God. I'm going to open up the Twitch oh, front no, page, which has this. an auto-playing video. And I'm going to do this in 80 times. Tabs. Okay, Holy here's how much shit. CPU and RAM it's taken up now. And now wow. we're going to do the same thing in a different browser and compare the results. Oh. You know, we were getting some really exciting data here when oh. Chrome crashed. Oh. I'm not drawing any conclusions, but either way, <laughs> if managing those resources your browser is using is important to you, Opera GX has you covered with a feature called GX Control, where you can use Hot Tabs Killer to see and close the most resource greedy tabs. You've also got a network limiter to manage how much bandwidth your browser is using, as well as a RAM and CPU limiter so that your browser won't stop your computer from running smoothly. Nice. And who doesn't love customization? You Darkness, can change your browser's like look from a whole bunch of preset options or even select color by color. You can also have custom wallpapers like this sweet free let's game it hey. out one. Or you can nice. even do animated Ooh. backgrounds. Looks great. It's also yeah, it super does. easy to import your settings from other browsers. You just click a thing, then the thing, and ta-da, you're done. Now, I want to show you my favorite thing in the browser, which is GX Corner. It shows you upcoming game releases stuff on sale, game news, and you can customize how you want to see it. Honestly, I love it, and I use it to keep track of a lot of random game info. Oh, and also, Opera GX is on mobile, too. And no matter where you're using it, Opera GX is totally free. So if the price of free sounds exciting to you, check out Opera GX by using my linky in the description below. Thanks again to Opera GX for sponsoring. Yep, still yep, here. Really Bad good. news, still though. There. It would appear that no, if the pans are on oh, the card, they don't fill with Stupid water. Physics. Still gotta do it the old-fashioned way. Fine, so be it. I'll do your hard work, see if I care. Now, you might be wondering to yourself, what do we need these for? Mm -hmm. Well, I'm sure this will come as no surprise, but gold nuggets can be melted into bars or sold to the jeweler, which means we go up here to the jeweler, hoist our little card up oh, here, yeah. sell for a few coins. Yeah, I'm rich. Anyway, what we really <laughs> need to be doing is getting more money, and here's yep. why. Welcome to the shop. There the are many like it, but this one is closest. Mine. That's oh. it. That's what it has going for it. Oh. And obviously, if we want some of these things, we're going to have to buy them. Yeah, Historically, I turned to these for starting. Cash. The fishing pole, or as it's been renamed, my first, first fishing, fishing pole. pole. Baby's first fishing Aww. pole. Rank one, cast into any of Hydrangea's rivers, lakes, or shores. Only cost 52 coins. I already forgot. How many coins do we have again? 26. That'll that never do. isn't enough to buy <laughs> the fishing rod. There we go. That's better. So I uh, might have gone a little out of control, okay. seeing as how I dug out this big uh. hole right here. But that's okay. I'm sure we'll find a use for it anyway. Alley-oop. Let's see how much we make. 828, 828. coins. 
Oh, all for us. Such riches. That's I'm definitely enough for us to buy this fishing pole. Oh, boy. Can't wait to make the real money. Oh, yeah. Wait the for fish it. Tank. Wait for it. Wait for it. Aha! Oh. We did it! A Yay. sardine. Caught in nature's tin can. <laughs> and what kind of fine price can I get for this? Five coins. That's so much work, though. How do I even get baby's second fishing pole? Well, <laughs> follow me. I think we know what we're gonna do next. Which is, we're gonna follow this here sign. Looks like we found the place. Okay, let's see. What do we got here? There's another oh. fishing rod under bulletproof glass. And then I guess we got this thing where we're supposed to pay with something. I can't just, like, I don't know, take Break this, it? can I? <laughs> what if I duck and shoot? Shove my face underneath. Uh, oh. Uh, oh, nope, still can't uh, take it. It was worth a shot, though. Maybe cash is what this needs. Here you go. Huh, nope, not cash. Well, the but sign does show fish. a fish, so let's bring him one. Ha! <laughs> okay, here you go. Enjoy. <laughs> What the hell do you want? Fish. You want more fish? Because if that's what you're bastard. after, I can do that. Wait a minute. Why am I fishing here? When I could be fishing over here. No, not at this dock right here. I mean over I... at this little pond right here. Ha! There. Is that better? Whoa. Here, have all these fish. Huh, that's weird. It's not letting me overturn the bucket. What about from the back? Oh, yeah, there we go. I'm sure that's oh, fine. Ah, uh, yeah. We did great. <laughs> uh, fine. Hey, look at this one. It's a cod. And this one, a mackerel. A mackerel. Whatever, get in there. Okay, are we good? Is that better? Mm. I sure hope so. What, what do the you tits? want from me? What, what else could I me? possibly pull from the ocean that you want? Like a redfish, maybe? Oh, oh. No. oh, <laughs> you want this thing. Well, okay, then. Let's just dump you right on top. What about now? Are we good? Finally! Oh, I see how this works. Oh. You give it whatever fish it wants, and God of Fishing Poles bequeaths upon thee a new fishing pole. New fishing In this blade. case, wonky fishing pole, rank two. Rank Probably two. a step oh. up from the previous pole. Nah. I'll be the judge of that, thank you. Time to fish all night. 30 seconds later! <laughs> Oh, it's so boring. <laughs> I don't have all this time to do all this fishing. Oh, but you know what I do have time for? Using these things. Mm. Fishing pot. Construct in water and catch fish. Really? Tell me more. Doesn't seem to want to <laughs> work here more. fine. Huh, not out here either, huh? What, am I need like a permit? What is this, a Cabela's game? Me, 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 me. You can't use that water. Okay, here we go. Back on our own land, we can finally do it. Well, it's there. Not sure what happens now. I assume we just wait. Well, that was easy enough. I think we know what happens next, right? Yeah, there we go. Oh Maybe my just God. a couple of these things. Essentially, <laughs> oh, as many as the shit. game would allow, up to the point where it doesn't let you build anymore. Oh and you're probably God. like, but Josh, that was probably expensive, right? How did you afford this? Look, I don't owe you any explanation, <laughs> except that I might have done some mining by hand. But don't judge me. We're about oh, solutions shit. here. Okay, so let's see. Look, you can see the fish right Fishy. now. Ugh, sardine. Oh. No, thank you. What about you? What do you have? Ah, oh, herring. That looks nothing like the picture the thing I need. But, kind but of a lot of work to go to each and every one of these things. Position your mouse cursor so you're on the fish. Pull it out. Be disappointed. Throw <laughs> it down like it doesn't matter. But I think I figured out how to speed it up. Come here, let me demonstrate. So when you put these things down, when it highlights blue, that means it's good to go. Uh -huh. And if you try to put it where something already is, it turns red. I but see. if you start the placement process right on this square, you can just keep uh -huh. placing it over and over and over oh on this one God. spot. And then That's once there's a fish brilliant. in there, it turns out there's actually several fish. Okay. Well, I think we know oh, where this God. is going. Okay, it's been a little while here. You, you wouldn't know it. Everything looks the same. But there's actually like 400 of these in one little yeah, space. Jesus, I collected man. all the ones in the river and did a little mining for some quick cash. Okay, let's see how picking up fish goes now. Oh, my God, there's so many fish. Oh, oh my go. God, it's still going. So I think what I'm learning, I don't think I can pick these things up fast enough before at least one of these nets catches another fish. Do you hear that Jeez. noise? That's oh the nets constantly refilling. Hang on, where's my bucket? Okay, now sit right there. There we go, picking up from the pot, dropping right into the bucket. You suppose there's a limit to how many fish you can oh, put in? Oh, we're about to find out. Many, many, many hours later. Oh, so, God. funny story. I sat here and put fish in the bucket for a little while. If we go underwater, see, it's right there. And as you can see, a lot of them escape. Just got to move some fish out of the way so we can access the bucket. Ah, see, there it is. I just want you to know, I have absolutely no idea how many fish are in here. I think like 10,000. So, I'm let's sorry. pick it up. And oh, the game froze. <laughs> Wait, no, it didn't. Oh, my God, the frame oh, rate is so bad. Is this is how many frames I get oh. while I'm walking and walking and walking. What Thank God we don't need to go very far. Oh, boy, we're getting there. Here's how buckets work in this game, by the way. The moment you drop something in and it settles, it loses all collision. And for that reason, you can fill these buckets with a whole lot of stuff, which is why I have no idea how many items are in here. I tried counting, but once you get into the thousands, it's impossible. Come on. Almost there. Good God, this took forever. This is it. Put it down. I swear 
one day it's going to get there. <laughs> Slowly but surely. Okay, let's see how we did. That's looking promising. Oh my God. 1.5 million. Amazing. Well, before we sell that, we should probably at least dump it out and see what it no, looks like, you right? Fool. Of course we should. Here goes nothing. Uh, Oh, there we oh. go. <laughs> now oh. there goes the fish cube oh. and oh. impact. Oh. Oh. What a splatter. Oh. And as everything separates out, all you see are eyeballs, eyeballs, and, and eyeballs. More eyeballs. Well, we've been stuck on this screen for a really, really long time. I'm going to guess every single one of these little fishies is trying to have its physics calculated as we speak. But it <laughs> no. hasn't crashed yet, so... Keyword yet. Oh, there no, we go. wait, there it goes. <laughs> Yeah, maybe let's not do that after yeah, all. I'll fool. just take my just money, money, thank you. Everybody. Well, now that we got cash in hand and an easy way to replenish yeah. it, it's probably time to do some shopping. But we can think bigger shopping. than this. After all, we can find more items in Bridgeport. Bridgeport. Let's go. So all we need to do is run down a road, over a bridge, and here we are in lovely Bridgeport. Okay, let's see. Where's the first place we want to spend our money? Now, normally, I like to swing by this place, Fabric's Fancy Furniture, because I have a fun history of stealing from this place. Oh, you know <laughs> yeah. what? We should be taking these thrones. 14,500? Can I just load these into the truck? Hell you yeah. sure can. Come on, boys. Load them up. Leave no throne unturned. No consequences. All cash. Hey, wait a minute. Do you see what I see? <gasps> what the hell is this sign right here? Oh. Gasp. Wanted. Let's game it out. Wait, what? Reward. One billion coins. Wait, yes, well, the game? I never turn down an opportunity to make money. Looks, Looks like, like we what? know the first thing wait. we're buying. Welcome. Wait. Welcome to Hobson's Power Works. Always open. All the best items. Items always in huh? stock. Hey there, Mini <laughs> Nuke, come with me. You know oh, what they yeah. always say, to make an omelet, you gotta break a few eggs. Oh, God. Ah! <laughs> nice. It's still going. It's, it's still going. So. Ah, back in the saddle again. And let's just hop down here. Ah, a cube de la let's game it out. Come here, you. And down you go. Ow, be careful. Shut up, me. You're worth too much to care. <laughs> now, so. where were we? Huh, that's a funny way to say billion. But whatever. I Oh, my soul! <laughs> oh, what happened? Josh Cube, talk to me. Oh, fiddlesticks, oh, it's gone. Geez, it's... Well, everything feels the same, kinda. <laughs> All my work here is gone. And uh... over here in the shop, there's an extra table, haphazardly shoved in front of the other tables, full of mysterious curiosities. Creative wand. Oh, my <gasps> God. I must be in creative mode now. Uh, I remember the devs the talking mode? about this. And if it's true, I can just steal anything. Uh... So let's find out. The legends are true. We are in creative mode. Hell Finally, yeah. we can do anything we want. Let's start by trashing the place. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, that's oh, what I'm talking about. Yeah, this baby. is what victory feels like. Fuck climbing yeah. on top of a pile of crap and looking down at a bunch of beds that I'm going to call casualties. You know what I did forget <laughs> to do, though, is grab those specialty items before they got buried uh, forever. Uh, that's okay. I grabbed a couple just in case. Now, this hourglass does something very special. You can adjust time? the time oh. of day and then also pause it. And next up, we got the flight cap. Put it on. Look to you the skies, fly. and gravity is a thing of the past. <laughs> and you feel fashionable. <laughs> Looks like I'm up as high as I can go. Oh Quickly, God. to the borders of the map. Let us have adventure. Oh, oh, we hit an invisible wall. Still, being able to fly to the boundaries of everything is going to come in mighty handy. And the best part is you can take it off mid-flight. Woohoo! Ah, ah. <laughs> oh my god, that picture perfect landing. Nailed and this it. thing. Ah, it's like the gravity gun. And huh. well, that's lovely. And lastly, we the have this wand. magic wand. The creative wand. Duplicates items and can destroy them. I'll be the judge of that. Uh, ah, very nice. Now be gone. You know what's another great perk of creative mode? Prawns be damned. <laughs> I want that fishing rod now. Why, thank you. How about another one? And another. Uh, and more. another. <laughs> oh, yeah. If you <laughs> just keep pushing this button, magical oh, things God. happen. Isn't it great? Oh, ah, what fishing rod rate. would I like to use today? <laughs> oh, there's just so many. I don't My know which rate. one to choose. I don't know. Maybe one will choose us. Ah, perfect. I choose you, fishing rod. So now we're going to head back to Bridgeport, because I need you to see probably the best thing about creative mode. Now, here's the thing. If this were not creative mode, you can only build in designated this areas. Everywhere else, like the city, you're not just allowed to build. Mm -hmm. But here in creative mode, besides shoplifting, we can place stuff anywhere we want. Oh, God, I guess no. that means we literally own the place now. Okay, so let's get started. And what a relief to only have to grab one of each thing, Ooh, since our magic wand will take care of the rest. And then let's back up here and let's get the things that matter most beautiful beautiful conveyor Cash. belts um, and yeah. my personal favorite ah. good old-fashioned explosives Explosive. i like the idea that we can just take dynamite just kind of willy-nilly drop it in here with all the other stuff and now it's time to take all this stuff to our first destination here we are at beautiful south hope i sure hope not <laughs> 
Speaking of south, we should probably do a little starter digging. And sure, we could use a shovel, but I'm pretty sure we're above that now. Isn't that right, Dynamite? I'm sure you're up to the task, right? And a whole bunch of your closest friends. Okay, there we go. Oh, Just gonna God, make though. a nice little space. Huh, I was expecting a lot more. Ah, I see. For when we want that surface huh. of another planet look. Yeah. Well, so be it. Sure beats digging by oh, hand. Dear Hopefully this will do the trick. I sure south hope it will. Ah, that's more like oh, it. Yeah, God. I think it can it's work crater. with this. In you go, truck. Ah. Okay, you go there, and you go there, and as you can tell, I have no order for anything. Just Hell like yeah. I like it. And of course, we're gonna need a way out, and nothing says expensive operation like a dirt ladder leading out. You can laugh all you want, but it totally worked. So as a reminder, we're still gonna see if we can find this onyx material, because apparently it's really, really rare. Okay, so we got a couple different types say. of drills we can use. This one here is called the ram drill. So we'll just ram. build a handful, and you see these ports in the back. That's because they take water to use. So before we get too involved in those, let's go ahead and hook up our pipes. First things first, we take this intake pipe and just slap it right down. That dreadful noise is how you know it's working. Uh, 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 no. Why? Thankfully, this thing will take care of it. Uh, and we'll just keep running Sweet these pipes. Lady. And over to let's crater it out. Okay, hey. there we go. Not the most efficient thing, but since when have we cared about that? Let's True. turn the water back on and let's see how this works. Alright, let's give this a shot. Ah, Beautiful. perfect. Little crappy pieces of dirt. Awesome. Let's make a couple more. There we go. Even better. Oh, Got a bunch of drills yeah. and they're all working. Except they have nowhere to go quite yet, so it's just piling up. So we're going to use these little vertical guys to really get the dirt moving. We're going to set up a different area for processing. Compliments of our Lord and Savior being able to build anywhere we want. Oh, Hold, please, God. while I build some oh, stuff. No. And we're back. Hey. Who wants a tour? I know I do. Same our here. journey begins, as you'd expect, with these little rocks heading away from our facility and finding Finding new life hopping over the South Hope sign. <laughs> so after our little rock friends fall off this little cliff, it's time to head to town. Oh, and it's at this God. point that we have a series of zigzagging back and forth conveyor belts that take us all the way into dear Bridge God. 4, where they take a little deviation from Main Street to cut through where the carts are, at which point we have a small leap oh of faith. God. There you go, fellas. Trust in the system before heading on over to Hobson's Power Works. Don't forget to stop at the gift shop on your way going? through town and maybe get a snack. After Come all, on. It's Come quite on. a climb. And then it's Joss. time for another jump before cutting Joss. through these buildings and onward to Main Come Street. On. After that, it's back down to ground level where you'll cut through Joss. the giant skull and then <laughs> off you go back out of town. And then it's time for a painfully long oh. jump all the way out of town until we get to lovely Drek Quarry, which feels even better because I didn't pay to use this land. And eventually we come to this, the grinder. Dude, this cuts the rocks into smaller God. rocks so that they can more easily drop into this funnel, which takes us to the next Whee. part of our place where rocks fall down in order to become gems. Don't mind all this stuff, it's all for show. All the magic really happens right here. Rocks fall in and out come various minerals. Now it's Ooh. time to head back to the surface where our little mineral friends get to take a little climb. A very little climb. Dear That's God. right, they gotta go up in the sky again. And for that, they gotta go up the spiral. And once they've reached the top, it's time for another journey, which takes your gems to this Just, little guy. Now on, it's time man. to head you back down, it. all Just. the way down. Oopsie daisy, watch your step. And for the blessed few that make it, it's time for a washing. Compliments of our beautiful sprinkler system. And now that the materials are nice and polished, it's going. time for their descent. Back to where they started. On the ground, back at the original campsite. Where I can come over and crawl on my hands and knees, pick them up by hand, and see if there's any onyx in here. No, no, no. I guess I'll just have to stare up at the sun and wait for more stuff to hit me in the face. Thank you. It's probably going to take a while for this thing to start processing tons of materials. So I'm just going to let this run for a little while, and then we'll check back in. How many hours? In. How many? See you shortly. Eight hours later! <laughs> Okay, it's been eight hours or so. Let's see how we did. Ah, I see. No gems at all. That's the process working. <laughs> Let's see if we can figure out what happened. You might notice that the frame rate's doing the really well, which eight. makes me feel very optimistic. As we head along the thoroughfare, oh we can God. see that even though we have some casualties, a lot of the rocks are still making it down Jesus the conveyor belt. Man. And as we get closer to the part where it makes the gems, I couldn't help but notice we have very few rocks that made it this yeah. far. And also due to the uh, sluggish frame rate, I couldn't help but notice how long it's taking these. In fact, I sat 
sat here and watched this oh, one rock to see how long it would take. And while I sped it up for you, it took 30 minutes for a rock to go this distance. And then once it got down into the facility, it took another 30 minutes. And then the trip up from here took 45 more minutes. And do you want to know where its journey where it ended? Going, Two hours later, they got stuck <laughs> on these little ramps. That was their triumphant journey. They didn't even make it to the rest of the stuff. Well, I'm going to call that a huge success. We didn't find any onyx, but we found something even better. The friends we made along the way. Nah, I'm kidding. We ruined the frame rate, and that's enough for me. So I hope you had fun. I know I did. Thanks again to Opera GX for sponsoring. Link in the description, and I'll see you next time. Oh, that's gonna do it for this with ladies and gently genty gents. Oh, yeah. You know what? I'm not surprised that he broke reality, but at the same time, creative mode with the main man himself? Yes. <laughs> This is good. Let's go do it for this one, ladies and gentlemen. If y'all like this video right here, take your pretty smart collars of awesomeness, yours. So, hit the like button. Boy, and until next time, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, peace of all ages, saves, and sizes. Love, peace, and above all, stay be small for the epic win of all the wins. Oh!